Wow, hey, we bring her right in, Sam. Uh, all right, there we go. Hello, how you doing? Welcome to the Opie and Anthony Show, Caitlin. Take a seat, Caitlin Farrington. One there gold in the go. women's half pipe. How cool is that? Yeah. That's pretty goddamn cool. It's been pretty awesome. Yeah, I bet. Where are you from? Um, Sun Valley, Idaho, originally. Right on. Say, so you've been like snowboarding, skiing, everything. Yeah, right. I skied. snow. I started skiing when I was three, and then swapped three. over to snowboarding, and so three. been yeah. Were people even... like snobby, like like oh she's going to snowboard. Uh, <laughs> no, my parents were maybe a little bummed at yeah. the time because they were big into skiing. But... Skiers don't look; they look down at snowboarders, right? Um, sometimes. Yeah, yeah. not a, not as much nowadays. Not not yeah. It but used at to first, be. it yeah. was you either did one or the other, man. Absolutely. Yeah. yeah. Now, my neighbors in I live in Salt Lake City now, and my neighbors when I moved in the house next door, they're like, "Don't talk to my kids because they ski at Alta, <laughs> oh. and that's in a resort that doesn't allow snowboarders. They don't so, allow snowboarders. Yeah, one of wow. I think there's three in the U.S. So we shan't do. have snowboarders. <laughs> why do they? Why do they like? Why do they like you guys? I don't know. I think because we're different. We they get a, a There's an image. There's an image that uh, snowboarders present, like they're smoking weed all the time. Smoking yeah. weed. Party yeah. image. Yeah, yeah, a lot of party. A <laughs> yeah, like. lot of long wool caps and wacky attire. They like well dressed people on the slopes. But they ban snowboarders. Ah, that's kind of silly. You don't want to hang out with those people anyway. Then that is. That's silly. And then how did you start competing? Like, uh, you just figured, hey, I think I'm really good at this. <laughs> um, one of my good friends, Heather Black in, from Sun Valley, she kind of, like, was on the Sun Valley snowboard team. And I would go snowboarding with her every day when she was done with team. And mm -hmm. she convinced me one day to just, she's like, you should join team with me. Like, let's go to Wendell's one summer. And so went to Wendell's and then started competing with her just kind of started the tour of snowboarding and mm. it was pretty funny because like everybody used to joke with me they're like caitlin you just do this for the dudes and i'm like yeah uh. i was in high school <laughs> and so i was like yeah pretty much i just like do this for the dudes you were the chick that was like doing what the guys were doing on snowboards <laughs> yeah. yeah trying trying <laughs> and then fast forward you win the gold medal that's that's like crazy, crazy. Yeah. Cool. it's been awesome god do you get bored cool. with regular guys um, no. No, you like this. But wouldn't you <laughs> like, mean, if you were dating snowboarders, it's probably right. hard to date someone that's just got like a regular nine to five job. Uh, yeah, I guess we probably don't have that much in common. But <laughs> I don't know. It's whatever. <laughs> yeah. What else do you do besides snowboard for fun? Um, I play golf. Wow. Actually, through the summers, I've picked up golf, and so I've been playing golf. I don't know, just kind of whatever <laughs> comes to mind. What a I'll great do. life. <laughs> I know, right? Do you, actually, do you have to make money? Um, I make it snowboarding, so oh, that's great. there's enough money to to be made, huh? Yeah, that's endorsements all. and stuff now. Yeah, sponsors. Yeah, and it's kind of all of that. So that's pretty. pretty that is cool. awesome. <laughs> yeah, my roommates in Salt or my old roommates in Salt Lake, they were just like, man, Caitlin, you just make our life seem like it sucks because <laughs> they're like going to school every day and kind of doing that and then i just gotta sit on the couch and be like what should i do today so how is living in salt lake like it's just two like camps in salt lake right isn't there like the strict mormons and then there's kind of like the party people yeah i mean not so i don't think like the mormons are they're in Salt Lake, but not as many. They're more okay. north, like in Provo or south. Or wait, that's backwards. South in Provo and <laughs> yeah. north in Ogden. So I don't know. You don't really get that many. But yeah. Um, and then with like the University of Utah that's there. Mm -hmm. It's just all college kids. Yeah, from and all over. Mostly all of them are like moved to Utah just to ski and snowboard. So mm -hmm. yeah. we got the answer to the question. The skiers want in badly. This is so stupid. Uh -oh. uh, David in Houston, go ahead. Yeah, how's it going, guys? Hey, buddy. We got Caitlin Farrington in studio. She won gold. Congratulations on the gold. Thanks. I was just going to call and say, you know, uh, skiers don't really care for snowboarders because the snowboarders, they tend to go a lot slower. 
And they also just sit down in the middle of the fucking mountain. And the corner, there's a, just a snowboarder sitting on the mountain. <laughs> it's kind of true. Do you just sit down? <laughs> um, I mean, sometimes we sit down, but not like in the middle of the mountain. I feel like the skiers go from one side of the trail to the next oh, side and make right. these like, big turns. Sweeping and then... S turns and stuff. <laughs> yeah. Well, when you're going that much faster, you've got to make a turn. You can't control that. Yeah, but you go all the way across each run. At least <laughs> stay out of everyone's way. Yeah, at least they're not snow. On. At least they're not snow plowing <laughs> down the mountain. There's pizza. And no way to make, yeah, no yeah. way to make pizza, pizza slices, slices when you're snowboarding. Right. All right, let me say hi to Alan in Florida. Alan. Yeah, I know. I live in Florida now, but I've been skier for many, many, many years up north, and I've done both. I, I, I switched over to um, snowboarding and switched back to skiing. I do both. But anyway, whenever I'm skiing, I do feel like the snowboarders are in the way, and whenever I'm skiing, uh, when I'm snowboarding, I feel like the skiers are in the way. And it's just like uh, this young lady said, the skiers will basically go across the whole trail to get down. The snowboarders kind of just kind of barrel down on a nice line. So it's just the... Uh, it, it, we do get in each other's way. There's no doubt about it. Wait, yeah. you, you guys don't go down separately? Like, you'll just both... Just, everyone just goes down when they go down? Yeah. yeah. What do you think? So, I, I thought there was some kind of an order to it. Like, no. So, no. So you'll go down and a guy will just ski around you and keep going? Yeah, yeah whatever. Oh, wow. <laughs> I love Jimmy's thought. It's like everyone's got to stay on line. Oh, yeah. You're like Nazi skiing. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> straight line. Every, we must have a wonder. Oh, no. It's, oh, I didn't realize it was just a giant cluster fuck down the hill. <laughs> snowboarding and crossing. and The Zaxxas have... Yeah. Happening all the time. Exactly. People are just slamming in wow. into each other because they don't know what the fuck they're doing. There have you had great videos, with yeah. other people? No, not oh, okay. I haven't, but I've had friends. I've seen them go down, too. Yeah. It's not good. Brutal. It's not very pretty. You just see skis flying everywhere. And just, <laughs> what do they call that? Yeah. Uh, uh, yard sale. Yard sale, of course. Oh, yeah. yard yeah. sale. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's a good one. We got, I think, one of your friends uh, calling in. Oh, good. Do you know what Jeremy Jeremy uh, uh, Black. Park City. <laughs> Jeremy in uh, Park City. What's up? Oh, I don't know. Caitlin, it's Cooper. Oh, what's up? Oh. Hi. Congratulations. <laughs> Thank you. Who's uh, Cooper? So awesome. I watched you uh, just kill it on TV. Oh, thanks, Jeremy. Yeah. He works at the Park City Mountain Resort. As oh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. They, they must all be oh, yeah. pretty psyched. Just friggin' yeah. going crazy now. What do you got for uh, Caitlin, Jeremy? That's it. I want to congratulate her. I've watched her uh, train a lot at Park City, and uh, just wanted to congratulate her and give her a high five of her good over the air. Yeah, thanks, Jeremy. I'll see you when I get back to the Park City. Damn. Awesome. Do you have to go back to uh, so Russia? She? No. You know? You're no, not going to go back for the closing ceremonies? No. It was just kind of too much traveling, and I got stuff here, and I'm, I'd like to go home to Sun Valley because Sun Valley, like, helped my parents get to Russia so they could come watch and mm. just, like, have supported me through the year. So I'm just going to go back there and hang out. They're throwing me a big street party, so nice. <laughs> it'll cool. be pretty fun. Wait, what, what happened? With the closing ceremony, you're going to miss that just kind of going up there and getting the medal. Do you have the medal yet? Or yeah, I do. Do you have it on you? I do. It's in my back. Oh, yeah, we got to see the gold medal. Oh, Hell yeah. <laughs> a real gold medal. That's pretty goddamn cool. Oh, there it is. Wow. Yeah. Wow. Not everybody can say they got one of those. <laughs> wow. That's heavier than I would have thought. Yeah. Everyone says that, I bet. <laughs> oh, it's heavy. Yeah. Like to put it over your head. <laughs> oh, there you go. That yeah. is cool, man. Here you go. You can put that away. Thanks. Hey. Oh, <laughs> oh, sorry. You guys see it a lot. I want to see it. <laughs> oh, that is pretty cool. Wow. Way. Ooh, gold medal. <laughs> Yeah, so I already got the medal, so I don't need to go back. <laughs> How much could you sell that thing for? I don't know. That was my joke. People were like, Caitlin, what are you going to do with that? I was like, ah, I might just auction it off on eBay. <laughs> <laughs> like, well, really? <laughs> uh, I don't know. The ribbon looks like it's wrinkled, and we'll have to put it in a frame. I'll give you $20 for a pawn shop, assholes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, that is, that is heavy, but that's cool, though. Yeah, it's almost. It has an image. It's like I got a. What's what's that cutout? It's, like, it's obviously a circle, but there's a cutout in it. I think it's like a mountain range. Yeah, that's a mountain kinda. or something, mm. right? Yeah, that's I got to. I got cool. Instagram this, so I look <laughs> yeah, like a fucking star photo. today, man. <laughs> <laughs> Have you just walked around the house wearing that? Um, no, but it's been in my pocket for the past couple of days yeah. because. 
People are always like, oh, where's your medal? And actually, Kelly Clark, she's like, Kayla, the best thing to do is just keep it on you for the next month or two. Yeah, because everybody's going <laughs> to yeah, be asking. everyone's going to want to see it. I, I would like, put okay. it on, though. If you like, go into a store or something, I'd just be like, hey, how you doing? Yeah. And they'd be like, oh, is that a... Oh, yeah, it is. <laughs> oh, yes, it is. Yeah, I just won this. <laughs> yeah. Actually, I did that to the hockey boys in Russia. Yeah? I was like... Oh, the hockey boys. What's that about? and introduced myself, <laughs> and they all were kind of just looking at me like I was crazy. I was like, yes, this is a gold medal around my neck, so... Ooh. <laughs> Burn. <But. laughs> Very nice. That was pretty good. That's so cool. You man. should get the gold medal discount. You should walk around and just go to the That's stores. It. People right? should That's... just give you free stuff all the time now. Yeah, what were you... I like your guys' thoughts yeah. on that. What were, you, what were you thinking when you won the gold medal? That's pretty good. Um, I was thinking, this is fucking awesome. Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> nice. I was like, I can't believe I'm up here because. I don't know. I wasn't expecting it at all, and I think a lot of people weren't expecting me to win. So right. it was just a good experience all around. How was the actual village uh, where, where everybody is staying? Oh, I mean, we've I heard wasn't, rumors, Caitlin. I know, but I we've wasn't. Heard that it's I wasn't a party. staying in the village actually. Why? And, oh, are you too good for the village? No. Are you? <laughs> all those bronze and silver metal pigs. <laughs> <laughs> I don't hang out with the curlers. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't have enough room for us when we got up. Not there enough in pot mountain. in the village. <laughs> but then they also—it was a dry village, so you couldn't get alcohol or anything. Oh. In. And then kid, I know that people were like putting it in water bottles, trying to sneak it in. Oh, and really? Stuff, so. But yeah, I don't know. I can't imagine you're you're partying before your event. But no. I've, I I hear a lot of people do. I mean, because they got the downtime, so like, screw it, we'll party a little bit. Yeah, sometimes. I mean, so we were waiting around for a lot for a couple of days. We were there before, like we even could start practice. Hmm. So sometimes there's just not that much to yeah, do. Yeah, a little, little bored. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, you're like, oh, card games and a couple of beers? Yeah, sounds great. <laughs> <laughs> do they tell you don't leave? Like, Do they advise you not to leave that area like it's dangerous? Or? Um, They were telling us not to like wear our USA stuff around, but yeah. it was fine. It was like... Uh-huh. Yeah, they were making a big stink about it. Yeah. Here, and but. then, like, once we were there, it was really mellow. There was, like, there's a ton of... Se- I think they said there was, like, 25 security people for one athlete. So <laughs> wow. It was like, around, and, like, yeah. everybody knew where we were at at certain times, even though we didn't know about yeah. it. <laughs> did you see Bob Costa's eyeballs? Oh, I did not, but I heard. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty, pretty wicked. <laughs> He's oh, looking boy. pretty bad. <laughs> Oh man, worst, I, worst pink eye ever. Yeah. yeah. So what do you miss by not going back? Where, where they kind of stand there on? Do they still do that? Where they they'll stand on the the, the gold, the silver, and the bronze? Or oh, they she did, already did, did all that. Did that. Oh, you did. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. It's just the closing ceremony, which is one big, you know, little, little yeah, party. Yeah, little party yeah thing. it's kind of closing ceremony, and then and, and, I did and the athletes all up. wear their medals as they walk back in. Oh, oh, I and then I did miss going to all the events I signed up for, and that's about it because I didn't really get to see that many events while mm. I was there. Then I had signed up for like everything. Wait, you get to just sign up for whatever event you want to go to? Wow, that's cool. Yeah. What were you uh, What were you looking forward to seeing? Oh, I was looking forward to seeing hockey. I wanted to go to some figure skating. I had curling on my list. Curling. <laughs> now, do you like curling, or you just don't want to be rude to the curlers? No, I just I wanted to go check it out. I mean, they can. They're. It's legal to, for them to drink a beer while they're curling or something. Oh, really? Really? The, yeah, that's so hilarious. Like, we just got to go check this that's out. That's like bowling. At least. You know, you yeah. can just yeah. you drink, you bowl. <laughs> yeah. Damn. So <laughs> signed up for mostly every event I could. Some speed skating, but didn't get to check out anything. I like that snowboard cross. I think that's my favorite event. Oh, yeah. That's sick. Have you ever it, done that? No. I'm too afraid. I would just like, once the gate went down, I'd sit in the back, let everybody else go, right. and then me trail behind them. Sit down in the middle of the course like <laughs> snowboarders <Right>. do. <laughs> what is snowboard? What is that? It's like motocross, basically. Same yeah. kind of concept, but these guys are almost pushing each other out of the way to get down the hill. It's oh, wow. Cool. Crazy. Yeah, there's it's pretty six awesome of them to that watch. Start at the same time and race down the hill through and jumps like and turns. Jumps, turn, and, yeah. yeah, so that's pretty nutty. It's yeah. wild. Let me say hi to John in Queens. We're talking to Caitlin Farrington here today. John. Hey guys. Hey. Uh, Bill Burr killed last night. Great show. Absolutely. Uh, Caitlin, you did the U.S. proud. Uh, 
really, really proud of you doing a great job winning the gold, bringing it back to the studio. I uh, also wanted to thank you for being smoking hot and making <laughs> Opie and Anthony sound like stupid little boys. <laughs> he's not lying. He's on, he's on to us. <laughs> he's on to us. He's, yeah, he's, we, we do that. You yeah, know. We, we, get all, we get all shy. It's yeah, they're not used to oh, being around. Oh, they're bright red, red blushing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. We get just pigs in here usually. <laughs> 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 yeah, not not many athletes no. make their way through here. And so you're doing uh, you're doing uh, David Letterman tomorrow. Mm -hmm. wow. No, actually, it got moved up to today. So I uh, got awesome that this oh. afternoon. Does he got you doing something wacky? I don't know. <laughs> like we'll see. Build a half pipe outside. He'll probably build or... something outside for you, right? Yeah. Yeah. What do you do after this? Like, uh, like what what you want to? You a professional snowboarder, but do you teach people it, or do you? Where do you go with it? Um. Well, I'm actually I still got one more contest this year that I'm going to do yeah. in Vail, Colorado, the U.S. Open, and so going to do that and then the season's done and then just hopefully like some free riding and hopefully some powder and yeah enjoying it <laughs> some endorsements oh, okay. <laughs> walk around go meet people play some, some golf. exhibitions <laughs> play <laughs> like some golf that's yeah. a life of leisure isn't it right, nice right? <laughs> it's a cool you are living a life of leisure yeah, work on your chipping yeah <laughs> that, that rules work on your potting god damn you got yourself that's a hell of uh, life you got yourself one of those uh boyfriends no why is that? Is um, it your, your career too uh, important or no, guys assholes? The guys are assholes. They're nice. all scumbags. <laughs> <laughs> I've learned that this year that guys wow. are scumbags. Did you get fucked over? Yeah. Um, yeah, maybe a little bit, but it was for the best. So. No shit. <laughs> oh, there's a guy out there somewhere Damn. regretting it. <laughs> yeah, you're yeah. holding up your gold medal everywhere. Yep. <laughs> oh, you don't know, screw up the relationship before the Olympics. Yeah, what is he, an idiot? Yeah. <laughs> yeah maybe she came home with the bronze then. Yeah, you know. or no. <laughs> yeah, but it's a bronze. I don't think a lot of athletes like the bronze medal. I gotta no. be honest with you. They they look a little fucking mad yeah, when they grab that just bronze. Missed. Right? Well, yeah. I mean, at least I think the fourth place is probably the hardest. Sure. One. Yeah. You are you're nothing. Like, oh. I was so close to being on that podium. Right. Of that. Something coming home with a medal. Yeah. Yeah. How much did you win by? How much time? Um, only point two five. So it was really close. Wait, oh. point two five is less than a second. Oh well, well not we're really judged. Time. Yeah, yeah, those are point. Yeah, yeah. They're, they're judged on their uh, <laughs> tricks and stuff. Oh, okay, yeah. their moves. So yeah, I only won by a little amount, and I'm glad I did. Did you feel like one of the judges was, was not giving you what you deserved? No. no, I didn't even think I was gonna win. So I was like, when I found out that I was like gonna be an Olympic medalist at first, when I was like, oh my gosh, I'm on this podium. And then after the next two girls came down, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm actually, I'm on top of this So podium. you had two uh, more people that had to go down, uh, well, and I you had actually, to watch. I had, I dropped for finals, I dropped fifth, and there's 12. Uh -huh. So I got to watch, actually, I don't know, my, my, my I don't know, maybe, yeah, I could, but maybe I dropped sixth. And so then I got to watch six people, and three of them were other Olympic gold medalists from the previous mm, Olympics. Okay. And I got to watch every single one of them come down that half uh, <laughs> But it was fine. Just like, fall. You're just like, fall. <laughs> no. <laughs> yes. I, you know, I was just like, man, this is just going to be, right. this is tough. But I had a good run, so I knew that they had to do something spectacular to beat me. Yeah. <laughs> they, they find mistakes in things I would never see as mistakes. Like, it's amazing, like, what they look for in, in these type of mm. events because they're like, oh, but apparently the left leg should have been further back. Uh, <laughs> what? <laughs> what an asshole no. these judges are. <laughs> hey, with all the spins and the twist, it's amazing what you guys do. It really is amazing. Uh, we got Snowy in Michigan that wants in on this. Snowy. Hey, how y'all doing? All Hello. right. Hey, it's nice that Opie's resisting the urge of calling her a broad. <laughs> I've been on a broad kick lately. Oh, yeah, yeah. That's broads. right. Yeah, that's no, right. We will not be calling Caitlin a broad. It's like, a, yeah, people go to the Olympics, they've trained their whole lives and everything like that, and then Opie's like, yeah, I was watching this broad the other night. It's like, broad? I don't know. It's film noir Opie. <laughs> All right, Snowy, relax. Right, We're getting along really? here. This is, this is nice. No rat outs. Now you're getting thrown under the bus. Oh, boy. Oh. boy. This show do tends to do that. Yeah. Do you uh, really yeah. collect fridge magnets? Yeah, I do, actually. I know. I just saw that, too, and I don't like her as much now. 
<laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Why, yeah. why fridge magnets? I don't know. Well, I started out trying to collect snow globes. And you know how hard it is to get a snow snow globe on an airplane and not have it break all over your stuff? Yeah. (laughs) It's difficult. Yeah. Uh, It's happened many times to me. So I have a a shelf of broken snow globes. And I'm like... Those are like weapons at that point. (laughs) That sounds like the the title of your book. Like if things go really bad, a shelf of broken snow globes. (laughs) (laughs) Yeah. yeah, So I started with fridge magnets because it was easy. And you find them in the airport when... What's your favorite fridge magnet? Um, I have this lamb one from New Zealand. That's pretty funny. Oh, <laughs> why? Because well, it's just somebody goofy. doing something to it. No. something behind oh, the okay. lamb. I think you know. Yeah. I know. Is there a cliff involved? Or, you know. the gutter. Are you good at taking the magnet and flipping it onto the fridge so no, it sticks? I, no, no. Well, haven't tried that. You got I don't like a have magnet. Oh, you don't and keep that, them on the fridge? Yeah. Well, Probably yeah, got a I nice do. Sub-Zero fridge. It's stainless steel. They don't stick to that no. shit. No. I've got a fridge. My fridge is full of magnets. You know? All right. And you surf in New Zealand, right? right? <laughs> um, no, I've never have. I've tried. Oh, but, well, like, let, me, go, let, me, I, let me read this uh, point. Oh, she goes to New Zealand to surf. Well, no. Wikipedia. I go to that's snowboard. <laughs> research should be done. You snowboard in New Zealand. Yeah, though. and then I go to... Usually I'll try and go to Australia and... Go surfing you over there. So you know how to surf as well. Yeah, but I call it drowning because I'm not Damn. very good. No, That's scary. Yeah. You would think it's pessimistic like... attitude. <laughs> but you would think a snowboarder would would you know pick up surfing pretty easily. It's really hard. It's, so, it's that much different. Huh? Yeah, You're on the same it's... stuff. It's just warmer. Yeah, really. Yeah, yeah. But, yeah, it's a lot harder. So I call it drowning because that usually I'm just. And you know Gasping nothing's gonna air. come up from the snow and eat you. It's like <laughs> the water is scary. You try not to think about that. <laughs> oh man, when I'm in the ocean, I cannot think, think of think anything about. else. That that it, there's a lot of real estate under me, and there's literal monsters <laughs> down there. Fuck yeah. that. Keep me inside the boat. <laughs> yeah, nice there's, cocktail. There's avalanches though in snow, so you got to worry about that in the snow. Yeah, but not to bum me out. But yeah. Let me. Uh, yeah. You're a world traveler, so we're getting some good questions. Josh in New Hampshire, go ahead. Hey, Caitlin, uh, congratulations. My daughters and I watched you, and uh, you're a great role model for them. I really appreciate it. Oh, Ooh. thank you. Um, I just wanted to ask, uh, when you're when you're kicking around the Olympic Village, are there any athletes from a certain country that are just dicks? Like, the Ukraine <laughs> girls are just awful? Um, no, I don't think so. I think everyone's pretty nice. Like, I don't know. Yeah, you didn't need any, new. any real... Jackass. No, I didn't. And mm-hmm. because I had the gold medal, they were all like my They're best gonna friends. They're going to be nice, too. Yeah, yeah. They would like. But, yeah. Well, you're no. awesome. Go USA. Oh, thank you. All right. Did you really try to fund uh, your early snowboarding trips selling family cows? Yeah, we did, actually. Um, I grew up in <laughs> Idaho on a ranch, and that was kind of how I funded snowboarding was selling cows. How much did you get for a cow? Um, Like a grand plus. So, righteous buck. You don't get attached to them. No, I didn't name any of them, and they were as long all as you don't like, name them. yeah, they were all beef cows too. So it was either sell them or take them to the slaughterhouse. At one point, people in my life. think they're like. Uh, everybody gets this impression like they're the cows that you see in the 4-H competitions, all clean and everything. Cows are disgusting. <laughs> that green shit on their ass all over the place. They're licking their nose. They stick yep. their tongues up their nostrils. Disgusting. <laughs> <laughs> Thank God they're delicious. Yeah. Yep. Mm. You're not a vegetarian or anything, right? No. I don't think you're allowed to be from... Uh... <laughs> uh, oh, where, Iowa? Idaho. 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 Same yeah. thing. No, I'm kidding, of course. <laughs> <Come on>. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, yeah, yeah, that's uh, that's like the, the heartland. Yeah. Now, yeah. will you make a lot more money now that you have a gold medal? I hope so. <laughs> I hope so. I bet. I bet you will. <laughs> yeah, I might do I might do pretty good for myself. Mm, yeah. Just yeah. endorsing uh like a snowboard equipment. I mean what else what, what else can you endorse as a as a McDonald's. Oh, oh that's right. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, McDonald's. <laughs> restaurants. Yeah, restaurants. I don't know. I stuff. I don't know. My agent does that for me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Gosh, she's got the greatest life ever. <laughs> Has anyone been know. shitty since you came back, just a clerk in a store or whatever, and you just want to hold it up in their face? Um, no. That will happen to you. <laughs> it hasn't happened yet. Somebody will not know who you are, and they'll be kind yeah. of stupid, and you're going to want to hold that medal up and smash them in the teeth, and I suggest you do it. I wonder how around. long you hold the gold medal around before you finally go, all right, got to put this away. Just put it put away. away. How long, you think? I don't know. Kelly said, like, keep it around for a month, because everyone's going to want to see it. Yeah, so. and then after that, 
you could like oh, put sure. it away. Any yeah. plans for uh, four more years? Um, I think I'm gonna. I might try and go another round. I mean, yeah. I've got nothing else to do right now, so, <laughs> <laughs> so I'm just gonna That's keep snowboarding. <laughs> Maybe you just go That's another a, round. It's really hard to believe you want to call me. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's part how she talks. <laughs> Uh, great. Uh, That's the ultimate compliment, I guess. Oh, my God. <laughs> Most doesn't interfere with your golfing. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> <It's important. laughs> and your fridge magnet uh, yeah. collection. <laughs> she rules. Uh, Caitlin's on Jesus. Twitter, too, by the way. It's yes. K-A-I-T-L-Y-N Far, F-A-R-R. Right. Caitlin Far on Twitter. It. Do you tweet a lot? No, I, no. it's kind of Instagram. Oh, okay. Yeah. You get Instagram I like Instagram, that? and then it goes to my Twitter feed. Pictures of, like, uh, Sochi. Pictures of Sochi. Pictures, pictures of... You got a cat? Of, I do have a cat. There you go. Pictures of your cat. Uh, no. He doesn't, my cat is an asshole. His name is... <laughs> <laughs> and he hates everybody, even me sometimes, and so... Does he attack yeah. you? Yeah, he's like yeah. he'll walk around the house and stalk your feet and yes. just, right. like, get at you. Yeah. I know cats they, are dicks. Yeah, they, <laughs> they really <laughs> are. Every once in a while, you find a cool one, but yeah, my my neighbors call him Cat Killer. So Cat Killer. <laughs> well, just, did what? you not like? Were you not firm with him when he was young? Because Anthony's cat is is a savage, but because he let it do whatever it wanted. I spoil him, and I don't care because I think it's hilarious. <laughs> I bet people go, "Oh yeah," when he's doing something bad and you're supposed to reprimand him. I grab the camera. I'm <laughs> yeah. like, "This is hilarious! Look, he's chewing this apart." And we uh, yeah. we, we got a, a very good question coming in oh. before we let her go. Uh, Dave in Ohio, go ahead. Hi, Caitlin. I wanted to ask, how important is the board? That's <laughs> really important. Uh, yeah, how important I mean, is the board and snowboarding? That's a very I good would, question. Uh, what a great it's question. It's important, I guess, because, I mean, <laughs> <laughs> that's what you take down the mountain. Yeah. Otherwise, you're just a person falling down a hill. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> she you grab yeah, your, she answers it. it. Oh, I will. <laughs> it, it's a Larry King question that was a, actually asked of a skateboarder. How important, How important yeah, yeah. is the board in skateboarding? So that's where <laughs> that came from. I would from. say pretty important. Yes. Pretty important. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Almost the most important thing. Oh, that's your Instagram right there? Oh, look at that. It must be so cool. It's like, yeah, I got, you know, Olympics pictures up here. <laughs> is your, I do. Is your Instagram the same as your Twitter? Yep. Okay, good. Because cool. we'll, we'll tweet and uh, yeah. Instagram you. Look at you biting the metal. Oh, yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> do other people try you gotta to, do it. <laughs> do other people try to bite your metal and you're like, Ugh. No. Uh, somebody will. <laughs> Get my metal out of your mouth. Exactly. Knock <laughs> it off. Right. You can see it, but relax. That's pretty cool. For real, that's really what cool. What a blast, man. man. Yeah. You're uh, definitely a pisser. <laughs> it's been pretty fun. <laughs> I bet. <laughs> and Caitlin's on Letterman tonight, too. So uh, yeah, let's, yeah. You are, yeah. let's make sure we watch. Letterman. Do right. you know who else you're on with? Um, I don't. Oh, you don't no. check? No, I haven't checked. Unless you don't care. I don't know. <laughs> all all I about know is today. That's right. That's all that matters, right? <laughs> yeah. Uh, somebody <laughs> wants to know who is the blonde girl you're kissing on a Google image. Huh? What? Ooh, I don't know. Ooh. Let's go. Let's go to Google image real fast. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> yeah. Oh boy. No. Do you, ser no, do you search your name? I have before you yeah. definitely, and you find just some of the aw most awful photos of yourself sometimes, yeah. and you're like, man, why did they choose this one? <laughs> no, your Google image is all right. You got some good oh, ones. Oh yeah, you're okay. No. You're now all right. Now they're good. <laughs> oh right, yeah, yeah, because <laughs> yeah, that's true. yeah, because all these pictures go right to the top. <laughs> A lot of girls, when you search their name before you finish, it says like the name and then feet. <laughs> like people want to yeah. see them. Where are the, where are her it? feet? No. Yeah, Heather Mills' feet. That's a great Google. Oh, is that the photo? <laughs> I that mean, that's my one? mom. <laughs> so. Oh okay. God, Adam, it's her. It's her mom. It's a matter with you, Adam. Yes, it's her mom. So, you got a young mom. Yeah, I mean, I don't know what other photo he could be talking about. Yeah. So. I bet your mom's pretty proud, huh? Oh, yeah. So Both like, my parents are just Yeah, like telling everybody. On cloud nine. Actually, my parents have been divorced for 15 years, and wow. they traveled to Russia together, stayed in the same hotel room Damn. together, and my mom's like, the parent trap. I was like, Mom, stop. It sounds like a, a rom-com. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And now I talked to my mom yesterday, and she's like, me and your dad are just like best friends again. It's oh, like all the oh you know what that means. 
Yeah. No. <laughs> oh, no. What, that means. what do you think that means? <laughs> oh, no. I think there was a, yeah, what the hell. Yeah. <laughs> no We're hotel here. room. It's cold. <laughs> She's I'm reaching to win that. Olympic gold. <laughs> if, you, if they're best friends again, you know. <laughs> they're trying to win back a relationship. <laughs> <All right. laughs> oh, no just way. a horrible rom com. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Jimmy? Huh? Yeah, I don't a little know. Something maybe? A yeah. little, little Russian vodka involved? Yeah, oh, that's true. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> a lot of downtime waiting for their daughter. Sorry. A lot of downtime waiting for their daughter to, you know, compete. Yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah celebration yeah, yeah. Right. Right. Where's he putting that thing? <laughs> you know, they, oh, they got to tie in. Like, <laughs> All right, well, before we ruin a nice <laughs> relationship we started, why don't we know, get her out of here? We, I was just feeling a little comfortable. Right, you know, it happens. Yeah, we yeah. could joke around right. a little. I, I'm, I'm proud to say Caitlin is not abroad. No, <laughs> she's a gold uh, gold medalist, medalist yeah. in the yeah. half pipe. That is awesome. Very cool, man. I would go. I would go Thank back you. for the closing ceremony. It's a long trip. How many hours is it? Mm, it probably takes like 24 hours Ugh. to like get yeah. there and get back. Did they fly so, you a business class? I actually got upgraded for, to first class when I got on the plane. They're like, oh, we have a seat for you, Caitlin. Nice. And I was like, oh, yeah. Going or coming like back? It. Coming back. Of course, yeah. coming yeah. back. Yeah. Of course, yeah. coming back. Did the like, pilot ask to see? for you. <laughs> Did the pilot ask to see your gold medal? Um, yeah, I took photos and I got his wings. Oh, so. nice. Yeah. <laughs> what airline was it? United. United. Oh, nice. First class international? Very nice. Yeah, it was pretty good. Good yeah. for you. Yeah. got to sleep on the, the beds. That was about it. I was like, you guys, I'm going to be snoring today because that's I'm gonna nice. get horizontal and just snore my life away all the way back to America. And then you wake up and it's like time travel. Yeah. Exactly. Get those right golf there. clubs out and get right back to work. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing. From the minute you get on the plane, life is different now. you got to go yeah. now. Yeah. Mm. Well, we've got to see the front for you, man. Very cool. <laughs> All right. Thanks. Let's, Caitlin, uh, l let us let Caitlin go. Caitlin oh. Farrington. Are you busy? A lot of press and stuff? Um, yeah. Kind of. Yeah. Just a lot of talking about how awesome I am, pretty much. <laughs> 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 you know? I hear you. Yeah. A lot of talking about myself and, yeah. It's fun. Me. It's all about me. <laughs> man. Uh, uh, you got to come back and see us. Yeah. Thanks for yeah. having That's me. That's right. Very In cool. three years when things aren't so good. <laughs> 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 yeah. Very cool. Thanks for Thanks, coming on. Yeah, right. Thank Thanks. you guys.